Welcome back, it's your boy Rebel Show. We are back at it again. In today's video, I got the set of four DR35 GTR or the I forgot the in game name. But yeah, man, I ain't gonna waste your time. Let's get to the tune. Make sure you watch till the end so you see everything you need to. And yeah, man, let's get to the tune. So for front spring length is 8 for rear it's 5. Front spring stiffness is 180 for rear it's 80. Front damper is 4000 for rear it's 4800. Second damper is 5000 for rear it's 5810. Third damper is 3880 for rear. Same thing, basically. Just, yeah, there we go. Uh, fourth damper is 5630 for rear it's 5620. Front toe is basically zero. Same thing for rear. Front camber is minus 9.61 for rear it's minus 5.14. Uh, anterior bar for the front is 55. Same thing for rear 55. Caster is 8.8. .8, Ackerman is 100. Uh, Sting axis offset is 10, for the kingpin is 0, max steering angle of course. Wheels are 18, front and rear. Front tire weight is 225, same thing for rear. Front pressure for the tires are 100, and for rear is 200. Ahenian is 90, front wheel track is 14, for rear is 13. Uh, profile front and rear is 25%. Engine, external waste gauge is off, tune up is at 0, max torque, max limiter, the turbo is at 0 0.1. We are pushing 554 horsepower, not that much, but this car is smooth as hell, man. It's as smooth as a Supra, and it's really slow. <laughs> Diff locking ratio is at 100, final drive is 2.50, first gear is 2, and second gear is 2.20. You don't need any of these gears right here. Brake torque is 1300, almost 1400. Front brake basis is 45%, no ABS and no launch control. And yeah, man, I'm gonna go ahead and get in the lobby and show you how this bitch handle, my boy. This shit go crazy, bro. It might be smoother than the Super Tune MK5 Super that I did. Yeah, man, definitely let me know what you think about this R35 build as well in the comments below. If you have any car suggestions, man, let me know in the comments below as well. I'll do any car, bro. I, I'll do any car you want me to do, man. That ass, I'll do any car. But yeah man this this car right here <clears throat> damn and this car right here is the smoothest build man that ass this is such a smooth car bro i i did not oh my god what is this lobby man this lobby is straight up just ass and this man's bro i'm i'm tired of him fuck out my way but yeah man this car is so smooth you saw that 270 right there bro and you see how smooth it's transitioning and doing all of this drifting. Don't need much of a correction when you're driving at all. Just adjusting a little bit of the angle. Oh my god, why am I getting so close to those barriers, bro? God damn. I was not doing that yesterday. Well, y'all asked me. I, I streamed this build on, 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 on yesterday's stream. But man, this car is too smooth, bro. I'm telling y'all. Too smooth. And I don't think a lot of people will be able to handle this amount of control over your car. It's not only the car that is making me smooth, bro. So yeah, caster is 8.8 .8 on this car. Ackerman angle is at 100%. And no kingpin angle at all, zero. Alright, man, hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you click the video just seen on the screen right here. Make sure you drop a like, man. And see y'all next time. Peace, bro.